If he's on the register, yeah. He what, got seven to eight years in jail, be on there for life. Let me just have a look. Mr. Not Not wants to come up. Well, you need to. So. No, no. Regarding regarding what Kelly just told me and said, I know I know about that situation. So he, he. So listen, I I knew him because obviously he was part of the agency at the time that we was all in together called the A Team. So the A Team is still run, but he left. Um, there was always something dodgy about him, and I've always said it from day one. There's always been something dodgy about him, etc. But I didn't know the full ins and outs of everything, etc. Sorry, sorry, Ben Chocolate. What's his name? Full name? Uh, Clive Allen Feast. Um, no. If you want to know the online member, he's not funny. Back, sorry. So his um, date of birth is the 14th of September, 1984. So obviously, we obviously. We obviously gave him the benefit of the doubt, etc. Not knowing him from Adam, this, that, or the other, um, and then obviously, I uh, I got speaking to him. Um, he used to phone me quite a bit, asking to borrow money. I only ever once lent him money, but he paid it straight back. Um, before he went to prison recently, he uh, moved to Wales with some girl because apparently he'd uh, done something in London and then had to move to Wales. Yeah, oh, sure. correct. Thank you. Um, and then yeah. when he when he was in Wales, staying with a, a lady called Kelly, I believe her name was Kelly Marie, I think. Yes, it was. That's it. Um, she was staying there. I had her on the phone in tears, um, and explained the whole situation to me. Uh, there was nothing, no mention to an extent of kids, but kids were present in the house. Apparently. Six police cars drove from London to Wales, and three helicopters flew over to arrest this man. There was a, there's a, there was higher ups as well from London to come up. I've got the, I've got the videos of the police on yeah. the door cast. I've got them as well. Yeah, um, and uh, yeah, well, I did. The day, the day after, the, the day he got, um, and then obviously he was sent to prison, etc. Um, and then I, I'd never spoke to him after until the day he was released from prison. He then phoned me straight away. Hi, Fury. Um, uh yeah as you as you quite well know i've been in prison i was like yeah what do you want it was like i'm well i'm out now i said that's fucking brilliant what what, what do you want uh well i'm just wondering uh can i borrow some money because obviously i've got this i get fucked yeah, yeah and as a guy who, as a guy who's been in prison i bet you can remember your prison number fucking what pens you've been you know what i mean i bet you know everything about your prison life he didn't even know what I've fucking never, prison he'd I've been never. in <laughs> I've I've never been to prison in my life. All right, no, he really got asked about being in prison all the week, and he, he, he was like, "I don't know yeah. what prison I've it, been in." It's not. I've it's, got. It's I've not got. That five he don't six. want you to know. He ain't. That he don't know. Is he don't want you to know? Yeah, hundred percent. Hmm. Well, that's five, what set my red flags. Even before I heard anything <laughs> about him being the wrong one. I've got five or six mates that have been to prison and they know everything about prison. everything every day. Even to this day, they've been to prison like 20 years ago. They still know their number from when they was in there. They know what block they were in. They know what It's not even that, Fiori, right? Everything. And I'm going to make a point here, right? When you what? leave, obviously, anything like that, you get all your paperwork and whatnot. Oh, 100%. And on your paperwork, there is certain numbers, like there's all this and other that you're going to need in future life. If you lose this paperwork, because they'll, they'll always keep doing little checks on you and whatnot, if you, and they'll ask for certain numbers. If you lose this paperwork, you will get fined. Oh, yeah, 100%. Like, you will genuinely get a fine. But then, obviously, he's saying, because when we've confronted him, he's saying he ain't got this paperwork, this and other. So he says, well, go and ask for it then. Go and ask for it. And, for it. and he's made every single excuse under the sun. He Very had probation enough. yesterday. One second. He had probation what? yesterday and said he was getting it from probation. It come to obviously yesterday. And he says, no, probation said they're too busy. Bullshit. No, that's bollocks. Probation that's never too busy. Bullshit. You can't deny someone their records. Do you remember when he's you know, claiming out? mental health now, isn't it? Yeah. Do you, do you remember when this all come out after the, the whole situation with that, Kelly? <coughs> do you remember when it all come out, yeah. Kelly come on live and everything, tried to explain it, and every single person pretty much basically like didn't believe her. Enfield, from, Edmonton. Apart from the people that obviously have seen the footage, etc., and stuff like that, you know. And the, the, amount of, the, the amount of people that he's twisted around his fingers and made him feel sorry for him. You know, made him Clive Allen Feast. He was oh, charged. Wait. The offence happened in Edmonton Enfield, and he went to Wood Green Court. I was just going to say, wasn't it Wood Green Court? Twenty. Yep. Twenty. Two thousand and nine, two thousand and ten, weren't it? It's two thousand and ten. Yeah. 
Uh, listen, I am. Um, I, I literally just wanted to come in and just clarify what Kelly was saying. That was all. And obviously, everyone yeah, knows thank about you. the whole situation. So, if you've got someone else that wants to jump in a box to say anything, then I'll quite happily yeah. jump down. I had shared it to Callie, but I don't think Callie's about at the minute, is she? No, I don't think she's about. She, I know, I know, she Who's... was taking some time off for a little bit. Anyone know Pagey, baby? I'm not just letting anyone, a relevant person, in. Like, it's, you're not about this and don't know what you're talking about about him. You're not getting the box, mate. There's, there's no need. No, exactly that. Yeah, I think that might be someone I know. It's a while ago. Because if it's somebody who wants to someone get up that's got something relevant to say, I don't mind getting dropped. No, Does I'm, someone want to just jump and then I let them in and they're not relevant? Yeah, go on, I'll drop. I'll drop. It's not like we're not just here because, like, you know, we just want to talk shit and have a nice old time. We're here because this is a paedophile and it needs to be dealt with accordingly. Everyone needs to be shared. Everyone needs to be aware of this guy. If he comes back to the app, he's run away at the moment. If he comes back, he's going to get a form of another people and he's going to do the same bullshit he's doing to these guys. And again, your children aware, can be at risk, mate. Can. Open your eyes. Now we're aware. We'll do awareness on this ourselves as well. Right, right. Thank yeah, you. Yeah. If someone can yeah, do me a favour and send me over... Wait, he, sorry, wait, if, so, if someone can send me over all the information that you have on this guy to my Instagram, which is in my bio... I'll drop I'll, you a follow and then yeah, um, uh, I'll, I'll send it all to you. Straight away. Yeah, thank well, you. Yeah, it. you can send it to he, me he now and I'll send it through TikTok farms and stuff so that they're aware so that no one goes in. Yeah, yeah, yeah Fest was on the fucking. It was on the risings like less than three weeks ago. Yeah, that's why I yeah. just said like I'm sure yeah. I saw him on the risings. Yeah, it was on the it was on the risings the week after me because he because I had someone come in and tell and say, which yeah, obviously yeah. which obviously is one of my friend's sons and obviously Karina knows him, Tommy. Yeah, and I. That's I, the I, thing. Oh, sorry, and, uh, sorry. And I literally he turned around and said to me, he was like, uh, "Can you come in and battle him?" And I said, "Absolutely not." See, the thing is, yeah, any child abuse, right, is vile, yeah? But what he done to my sister-in-law was he put his hand down her trousers and tried to touch her inappropriately and tried to kiss her. Now, he got off with that. He went to court about it, yeah, he got off with it. So about, what, 10 months, 11 months later, he went on to do something 10 times worse. And I don't want to go into graphic detail what he made that child do to him. So not only did that child do it to him, the stepdad did it to her too, 10 times worse. Do you know what I mean? So this is real-life kids that are affected by this piece of shit. Like, it's not just hearsay, but you're... I would say you're a nonce in temper, do you know what I mean? Obviously I wouldn't, but people do do that. This is a real life nonce. Careful what you say, you'll get yourself an island. I yeah. know, but it's just so frustrating. I know, I know, I know it gets frustrated, but when you're bringing the oh, yeah, wedding thing so yeah. good, do you know what I mean? You don't want to ruin it. I know, but I had this guy, before all of this, obviously, so before far. my sister-in-law, I had this guy in my house. Do you know what yeah. I mean? I had him around my children, holding my aunt, well, I say uncle, <laughs> my newborn baby. I never thought for one second he was capable of any of that. And I didn't. No. You know, so to be having a kick in your teeth now, to then coming onto her live, talking to Jay, obviously about banning my account, he wasn't able to do with him. But anyway, I don't even know what happened with that. I don't really care. And seeing this guy, not knowing who he was until the next day, and then remembering who he was when I saw, a, obviously, a, you know, a younger picture. Uh, so I, I'm gonna, sitting I'm there, gonna like, down. fine. I'm he he traumatised these kids. Right, no worries, Tracy. Listen, uh, sorry, I, I know I'm going to say it again, yeah, but can you give people who have just come in a recap? Because in the last like couple of minutes, you've had like 40 people join. Right, I'm yeah, going yeah. to drop anyway. All right. All right, big up. Thank you. No worries. I'm going to sit in the comments. Okay. And yeah, I big up that. Remember to check your children's devices because this yeah, app, the, and Bebo and um, Roblox, there's the people on there that are older men like and they're making that. out they're the same age as your child. So your kids need to be monitored. Monitor your kids closely, mate. Honestly, you just I, can't, I can't. The internet these days. Yeah, look, they need a recap. People are saying, no idea what's yeah, happening. Yeah, right, yeah. So basically, basically, I come across Clive V. Well, Clive, yeah. I come across him. Talking a to Jay. K-Fest people. K-Fest. <laughs> Thank you. And I realised who he was the day after. I realised who he was the day after. And he is a paedophile. He's been to prison between seven to eight years for abusing a 14-year-old. And he, he then got away with what he'd done to my sister-in-law beforehand. He's on a sex offenders for definite, for life. He's been reported. I've, I can put up the thing again if you want me to. I've already reported him being oh, on no social worries. media. Live. That is the first thing I done. So, Liv, when he wakes up, to let Tony know that I'm going to be doing an awareness on this guy. I need him to jump in. We'll probably do this tomorrow, Sam, because of this one needs to be done. Respect, man. Thank star. you. Yeah, he's yeah, on somebody's the Somebody's saying. He was on somebody's the, saying what's Paige got to say. He was on the Rising Stars, what, two, three oh, weeks oh, ago? I don't I'm actually don't know. Paige, who are you? 
Sorry, I moved TikTok. I'm just looking through everything. I ain't got a clue, but it sounds really disgusting what you're saying, and I do feel really sorry for you to go through that. About Chase, I drop her. Down. I don't feel sorry. For, I don't feel for me, but yeah, you, there's no reason for you to be in here, mate. I'm not a victim here. These poor children <laughs> are me, not me. Right. The, the other comment that I've seen is somebody's put something about Karina and them lot. Uh, don't give him some money over there to get some data so he could stay on the app. I didn't give him no money. Tammy did. All right. Well, well, I'm, I'm only going on a comment. Mind, that I've seen. Never mind. Tammy is 18 years old, right? Listen, let me just tell you something before everyone goes on on this sort of thing, right? There's going to be people on this app that did support him that wouldn't have been aware of it, yeah? yeah. So no yeah. one can go yeah. in on anyone, all right? This is why these people, now they know, are it's bringing okay. awareness to it. If anyone then yeah. does support him after seeing this live, then obviously, yeah, that, that's a wrong yeah. thing to do. Yeah. But let's just be mindful, guys, at the end of the day, this is an awareness and anyone, like, could not have known it's what had happened until now. Mod, do, do, do you know what? A warning in the chat. <laughs> I've spoken to these girls in group chat for the past, what, four days now. And honestly, like, they're all feel sick. They're all gutted, mm -hmm. like, extremely gutted. Like, one, they didn't believe it, obviously. And two, like, you know, they supported him. They didn't know. And I believe in my heart, if they had known, they would not have been supporting him. There's no way. No, no way. They're good I'm girls, man. Funny, no backlash on any of them, It isn't please. something that you'd want people to know. So it's saying you're going to try and keep as quiet as possible, isn't it? Yeah, so yeah. who are the people who knew what he did years ago and supported him? Nobody. What are you talking about? Alicia, I was waiting for that. What this are you actually again, talking about? We'll, 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 again, guys, like this is something that people are not were and not aware of until now, until Lisa's brought it to everyone's attention. No one's being attacked. No one's, you know, at the end of the day, yeah. they're just getting it out there so that people don't support him, so that he's not on this app. Right, Lisa. I don't know who you are, Amy. I'm not modding anyone. I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> no. Yeah. No, you too, Lisa. Uh, put up the screenshots from Luca, babe. If you oh, don't shit, yeah. Yeah. Just I haven't covered names over though. And yeah. Are you right with me putting up the names? Yeah, put it yeah, up. I haven't. Yeah. Trigger warning. Thanks guys for just putting the trigger warning in. This is someone, or what she's going to show it in a minute, I'll explain it while she's doing it. This is someone who is, like, he's always claimed is his niece. She isn't actually any relative of his. Um, and she come to us the other day and she says, well, it was a little sister. A little sister was in the car, and she's like, "Yeah, he he, he groped me when she was when I was fourteen. Um, so at least as I'm obviously in here, I pulled her up on it. And obviously, if you read, you'll be able to tell. <coughs> Just screenshot it. There you go. But her mother prior to this also did get told. You're getting muted, mate. Me. I've had about enough of you. Lisa, if you need me to mod and help, babe, just mod this account. I think I have. Just any if anyone comes in here talking right, rubbish. I'm going to close it now, Lisa, because otherwise people are going to keep coming. Me and Kaylee, yes, we was very good friends with him. Like, very good friends. I've been for the past two years. Like, yeah, like at first, Lisa will even say, I didn't believe her. Like, fuck her, like, no. I was a girl. But then things started ticking, so then I went to jail, which then put me in contact with Lisa. And ever since, this is we've been dealing with this. And bear in mind, they've gone to him themselves and demanded paperwork of him. And he's made every single excuse in the book not to give it. He's also admitted stuff to them that he first called me a liar about. And this is not just like coming across someone you think, oh, fucking pedo. You know, this is a person who affected my family. My family then got away with that, then went on to affect another child. Like, mm -hmm. Can we just bear that in mind, please? Mm -hmm. Clive Allen Feast. You won't find much about him on Google. You won't. I've looked obviously. everywhere. I've looked it's everywhere. Worth, yeah, but you've got to remember back in, when was this? 20, 2010. 2010. 2010. He got I... on the register. Like back then, there weren't really much on Google. Do you know what I mean? Like, Thank they, you. That's what I said. I was there like first hand, not with the second kid, but the no first. Face, the I first correct? child. No face. Am I correct in saying that basically if it's anything to do with the child, they won't publicly put it on Google? You'd have to basically. Nah, they, yeah, it'd just be the register. Like if, if yeah. there were certain things. Yes, there was. The mother, the, the stepdad. The stepdad abused this child under camera 10 times worse than what Clive did, for the record. But yeah, Clive still abused her. And the mother was sent to prison too. <laughs> so the mother, the stepdad and Clive, three people went to Crown Court and the one court case and was all prosecuted for that child. Now, if we, I went to the I went to the court case, not the second child, my sister-in-law's court case. It was a three-day hearing. The whole three days, that little whatever stuck his head down, would not give any of us any eye contact. Is he on the app still now or has he done a runner? He's, He's done a runner at the moment. He's just made his account private on it. 
Yeah, it's made his account. Yeah, but the backup's gone. He's uninstalled the app. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, poor, ch poor children. This is two, two people he's done it to, and preferably a third. Whether this, you know, whether this Loopy is correct in what she's saying or not, I can't say because obviously I don't know. But the other two people, I can say. Remember as well, like we was in the same circle of people. Do you know what I mean? I used to live in Enfield, so his pe his friends, I know. His family, I know. I know everything, every single fucking thing, and I'm I telling you all now. Just 100%. I just want to suggest if you drop us all down, Lisa, because a lot of people aren't going to be able to read that because we're on side and it's taking most of the screen up because we're in a box. Do you want me to um, put it back to the other grid? But then I'll, how am I going to do that? Cool, I'm going to drop down now anyway because I've got a few things to add, but big up for what you're doing and keep smashing like, it, right? No. No face. No, no face. Thanks, no face. Send you a follow anyway. So I'll send you a picture. Yeah, 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 we'll do. All right, big love. Thank you. Yeah, I, yeah. I can't do it any clearer. Your best bet is just to screenshot it, guys. Like, I'm, I'm doing. I've done exposing life for about a year now, so I'm doing my best here. Yeah, come on. Yeah, I'm, is, I'm, I'm very passionate about this. I was just suggesting for his time, people with old eyes that can't see it. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. like, big up Lisa for doing this. Like, fair play to you. Like, it's, you it's know, not easy, know. man. No, it's not. It's fucking not. But you're doing but the right I don't... Thing at the end of the day. People's kids need protecting. Yeah, like, like she said, it was a random stumble across him. We'd scrolled yeah. in because Jay, Jay were in there. We were beefing Jay. And I'd already heard from Chris in Top Box. Oh, have you heard about June or okay first? I've heard some things about him being a wrong one. And then next minute, Lisa come in and it's like, boom, I fucking know him in real life. I know he's a wrong one. And I know Lisa yeah. shouldn't say it without it being right. Yeah, well, I no, know. man, this is quite close to my heart as well. Like, do you know what I mean? Because the girls infected, affected, the girls involved were affected. Obviously, I don't want to get bananaed, but they, they went, they didn't go unharmed anyway. Do you know what I mean? Put it that way. One child's got to live with this for the rest of her fucking life and she had it 10 times worse. And my sister-in-law, she tried to do something to herself not long after. Do you know what I mean? So this is real shit. And the fact of like, if I don't say nothing and I don't shout and scream and holler to the, you know, to get it out there, then he's going to come back onto the app. And it's going to come across new people, and you're going to have children. And a little friendly reminder, guys. Right, like please screener, do not have I'll... men that you don't know around your children from an app. Get yeah. to know that person first for at least a year. Yeah. Come on, and then I'll, have them around there. I already there, disappeared whatever, for this time, Karina, because he, he did fuck off, didn't he? And he's has only just recently come back. Yeah, he went to prison. Um, well, he went to prison for wasn't actually anything to do no. with children. Um, last time he not this got time round. Yeah, but mm. like I mean, he still came back to the app as soon yeah, as he got out. Yeah, he's come straight back. Yeah. And this, uh, now all this has come out, and it's just it's done a runner again. It's mate. done a runner across. Yeah. Yeah. But those putting in the comments about another guy called Liam Smith, I am aware of Liam Smith. But anyone that has actual resident sort of evidence, then you can follow me and I'll sort that Another out. Another Liam. Smith. So we've got Liam Cortner and Liam Smith. Fuck. I know hell. Liam Smith from the banter pages. He was on Facebook on the banter pages. He's always been an idiot. I don't know why people again. People see him having a mental breakdown. People see him and they still support him. It's ridiculous. I know. I don't get it myself personally. Mm -hmm. I've just what? been told and I've just been shown that. Um, I don't know. Uh, this guy K Fest's uh, TikTok is still there. It's still open. It is, yeah. It's still open, yeah. But he has apparently deactivated it, and it's all private and whatnot. So if it, if it comes on, it comes on. Isn't it? It's on and... Hold on, I think I just got a screenshot. One sec. There's uh, only got three accounts. Yeah, I'd say he's got a couple of he's accounts. Got one. Can... He's given one to this loopy girl, uh, and he's got another one, a fake account back. Fake that, that. Account. I don't remember what it's called. He's probably in here, mate. He's probably in here on the fake account. I'm gonna say, I'm pretty sure I've got an account that I still follow him on. Do you want me to go and find it and share it? <laughs> Who's this SSD? Shake I don't know. I've not got a chance to. Oh, do you know what? Fuck off, mate. You <laughs> absolute moron. Get up, Suck your mum. Suck your mum, you fucking imbrick. I'm trying to raise awareness, little dickhead. Get out. Honestly, people, come on, like, this is not a joke, man, come on. Show us something, this isn't a clout, Okay, so how about this? How about all of you? There's 165 of you in this live. Go and report that account. Lisa, I've just sent you screenshots that I was received, so I'll just send them over on your WhatsApp. Why are people so fucking weird, man, honestly? I know. You see, like, 200 people in a live and think, yeah, I'm going to jump in the box. Serious, man, it's not a fucking joke. I know. That's why I'm losing my shit. I don't understand it. Just don't. Just, just, just chill. I don't mind doing a recap. Especially even more for so people that have got life. kids and been through it or whatever. Do you know what I mean? Yep. 
exactly that. Is uh, there any reason for you to come up here? SSD, suck your mum, bro, and get out of here, you daft cunt. Hello, can I'm we help you? Enough. I've got time oh, okay, for you. No worries. Uh, Ruby, no, not, 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 not this moment. Still does have though. an account. Yes, Leon, account. bro, you're good. What's that? Keith still has an account. Yeah, no, we know. Um, <clears throat> I don't have him blocked. The reason I didn't have him blocked was because I wanted to keep an eye on him as well. Um, he's been doing this randomly for quite a while, to be fair. What, paedophile him for quite a while? Has he really? So what's anyone done about it then previously other than now? He's been reported numerous times to the police, but uh, okay. he's getting evidence to state that they're not minors. They're actually over the age because they lie to him, apparently, and the messages state differently. Okay, is but do you have one, proof on this? Right, is another one worse, where it? it's a case of the police and the Crown Prosecution Service not doing the fucking job? It's Sammy Leon. I've got a warning. Connie, you've got a warning. Connie, come down and come back up again. Yeah, basically, he he changes. Do you have? Things, hold up, can I just delete? He, he knows a way of deleting stuff from his devices so that it's not traceable. But so that's the thing is, no, it. it doesn't that's matter. Impossible. The thing is, what really grinds my gray is, is it doesn't matter if it's deleted because police can still tra take his phone and bring those deleted yeah. things back. He's had five devices taken off yeah, him. He just goes out and buys another. He shouldn't be on any any uh, anything. That, that, that's yet. incorrect because if anyone's been kind of accused, I mean, as you say, maybe he's got around it that he's lied and basically said like, you know, yes, these people are basically lied about their age and he didn't know. Like, I get that. That's a fucking hard one to kind of stay still, but. The thing that's really annoying is that well, whatever's deleted on your phone, please can take your phone and bring back any deleted sort of media, text, anything, anything deleted. Yeah. Police are actually able yeah. to bring that back. And the fact of he's a he's a registered paedophile, he's on it's sex offenders, yeah. which means any allegation made to any minors, they will charge him for it. So I find that a bit hard to believe. I'm not I'm not calling you a lie, but I'm just saying whether you got your information I from, I don't find that correct. Lie. I don't know. Anyone who will sit there trying to troll in the comments, you really will just be blocked, mate. So just don't even go there because I'm not even, I'm not even, I'm not entertaining your bullshit. Like, this is serious, man. That's what I've just been doing, just getting rid of them. I ain't got no yeah, time yeah. for it. Whatever yeah. issues you got with anyone, take it somewhere else, but not in this live because yeah, you'll be blocked. I did accidentally push the button. I don't <laughs> Sorry, I've already been in once. I don't want to come back in. <laughs> no worries, <laughs> get out my box. Get out. Oh, get out. Get oh, out. No, it's definitely not something to be joking about. about. Yeah, no, Tia, no, exactly. I, I, get, I get what you're saying. But again, you know, if this is resolving children, then police are quite... They can, obviously, with enough evidence, they are quite stern about it. And like I said, if his devices are taken, then it doesn't matter what kind of sort of... It, it doesn't matter at all what's deleted on any kind of device it's they can still keep coming it back yeah but, they can they can get hold, hold of anything that's been deleted yeah 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 anything but again you know if this is a case of if this is a case then um if this is really a case of basically you know he's getting around it by saying he was lied to and and he didn't know how old they were then it's it's a hard one to kind of stay stick no, not if he's like a paedophile, he isn't. Now shaved his head because he's going to stay that if he's a finger. He's been it? diagnosed with yeah. testicular cancer and is having treatment. Yeah, he should have died. Oh, definitely, I've been a dirty little wrongin. Yeah, you got people out there that are nice people, mums and dads yeah, and nans and granddads, and they feeling sorry for him because of that. But I'll, yeah, that's I'll exactly never what it is. Forget, he was laid there in hospital. Is he still calling, having chemo? People? Apparently. For exactly, Amy, would have. Yes, still going for the risings. You know. And sat 24 7 <laughs> battling. I personally don't care about his diagnosis. I don't care if he's got cancer. I don't care if he died tomorrow. I personally don't care. I believe in my heart that he's got a waste of life. That's, the, you know, the treatment that he was given that cured him or whatever should be given to someone who deserves it. He's a dirty ass nonce. Yeah, well, he doesn't deserve nothing but death, mate. 